combat the addiction. This is a message from Jesus. Jesus speaking. Being a negative thinker is like being addicted to a drug, not just any old drug, but a really bad one that doesn't do anything good for you at all, but is simply terribly addictive. Once you've experimented and taken it, it automatically weakens your resistance to it, and it becomes a habit all too quickly. When you take the drug of negativity, every single trip is bad and pulls you further and further down into a deep, dark, slimy pit. When you open the door to it, you also unknowingly allow a host of other wrong things in without even realizing it at first. But no matter how long you've lived with negativity, you can overcome it. Everybody is tempted with negativity at some time or another. There's always going to be someone around who's more talented in a certain area or has something, no matter how small, that you wish you had. So the enemy starts there with something that is logical and truthful and builds on it. He starts so innocently. He mixes his evil temptations with bits of truth at first. And it can almost be comforting to catch a slight case of the poor me's. It doesn't take much to find a starting point to plant a negative seed in your mind. And if you don't resist it immediately, you'll find that it'll grow faster than you can keep up with. And before you know it, you've got a whole lot more problems than you bargained for. You know it isn't right to be negative, and you don't want to be that way. But then you get hit with... It's too late. I'm such a failure. I've already let it in and now I'm lost. And I'm always going to be this way. You look around and see that the garden of your heart is indeed a mess and full of weeds. And you figure, forget it. But at that moment, you have to realize that as soon as you call to me for help, and make the decision that you want to be rid of the weeds of negativity, then no matter how bad your habit is, and no matter how long you've been negative, I come with my mighty axe, and I will not only cut down the weeds, but I can cleanse your garden and clean out the lies. And together... We can turn everything around into a total victory.